the pieces that are being featured today were all made in Belize um, by my father and they were made over the last 20 years. That's why the exhibit is called uh, BAC 20 Peace Exhibit because these pieces that are featured have been made with love over the years and they are celebrating the Belizean pioneers and also people that have helped w in the past about the struggle with brown and black peoples around the world. So they are featured uh, um, Che Guevara as well, Fidel Castro as well, people that have helped um, black and brown people in Central and South America with about getting justice about the injustices that happened to them. So the importance of this is to remember those pioneers, to remember the people who paved the way, and also to remember that during this month of Black History Month that we need to reflect as a people, um, even though we are a melting pot here in Belize, um, we respect each other's culture. So this is just a time to celebrate our black Belizeans as well. This exhibit was supposed to be done 2000. That's why the 20 is still there. 20, 2020, right? And it was supposed to be a 20 piece exhibit. So basically I had the 20 pieces shaped up already. Then I, I didn't, I, November passed, I never have the slightest idea I would have been doing this. So that like, I had some paintings here, or three or four paintings, and so I came to get them, and Gilbert and son, make could do the exhibit. This is early December, so I said, what? This can't be a 20 piece, it have to be 20 plus 20. So, so I had some pieces shaped up, so I added 20 more, so it's a 40 piece exhibit right now. So 20 plus 20. And then, uh, like I said, three pieces were very important that had gotten scorched. Um, 2000 and this is 2023 so those are that's 23 years ago so I said those are pieces that to be part of the display too so basically that's where we are with the exhibit that it was it was a long time in the making and now it manifests you know